Pull tray number one out of the machine. Push the blue slider until it locks into the release position. Extend the tray. Open the output paper tray cover. Make sure the triangular mark lines up with the A3 ledger mark. If the triangular mark lines up with the B4 legal mark, push the blue slider until it locks into the release position and extend the tray once more. Lift the green paper stopper. Close the output paper tray cover. Press and slide the paper guides to fit the paper size. Fan the paper. Load A4 paper printing surface face down. Gently adjust the paper guides to fit the paper. Check that the paper is flat in the tray and below the maximum paper mark. Next, pull tray number two out of the machine. Push the blue slider until it locks in the release position. Extend the tray until it locks in the A3 position. Make sure the triangular mark lines up with the A3 ledger mark. If the triangular mark lines up with the B4 legal mark, push the blue slider until it locks in the release position and extend the tray once more. Fan the paper. Load A3 paper in the portrait orientation printing surface face down. Gently adjust the paper guides to fit the paper. Check that the paper is flat in the tray and below the maximum paper mark. Push tray number two back into the machine first and then tray one. Be careful not to misalign the trays. Unfold the paper support flap. 